We want to get back to our top story tonight. Zappos co-founder Tony Shea has passed away at the age of 46. Fox 5 is working to confirm his cause of death. Shea played an instrumental role in revitalizing downtown Las Vegas. Zappos was headquartered there and he launched other programs as well to bring in younger people to live and work downtown. Fox 5's Maddie White is live from downtown. That's right. At age 46, it's been confirmed to us that Tony Shea, former Zappos CEO, has died. He was a cherished figure in the Silver State for revitalizing downtown Las Vegas. A spokesperson of Tony Shea's downtown project said in a statement with a heavy and devastated heart, we regret to inform you that Tony Shea passed away peacefully today, surrounded by his beloved family. We don't have any details exactly how he died, but he had just stepped down this August as CEO from Zappos, and now his retirement in the summer with the downtown project Shea was a revolutionary he was pivotal in revitalizing downtown Las Vegas and he's widely lauded for re revolutionizing the shoe industry as well with Zappos and he actually grew up in San Francisco but he chose downtown Vegas as the place for the headquarters of Zappos he is very loved in this community. One man actually that we spoke to walked by and told us, I remember when he gave out shoes to the homeless. So that pretty much says it all. Very loved in this community and very recognized for his willingness to give back to the community, especially in the city of Las Vegas. And now people are reacting. Las Vegas Mayor Carolyn Goodman called Shay's death a tragic loss, saying Tony meant so much to Las Vegas, always dreaming, working to inspire and leading others to create a new vision for tomorrow. Our prayers and sympathies to his family, she said. So we will continue to follow the details of this story, try and get some answers about his death. But in the meantime, the family is asking for privacy. Reporting live, Maddie White, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.